Good day, you boobers. Woober, woober, tuber, you boobers. So, uh, this is my battery bank. Uh, this is my powerhouse. It's a cute little place. I've seen videos of it. Generator. Backup generator. <laughs> Some gas. It's been treated with the blue stuff. So I upgraded my battery cables to the two knot wire and uh, my battery charger that I can charge on grid voltage and my 3000 watt Ames Pure Sign 24 volt uh, inverter. So as you're at that panel with the uh, diversion on it and over here is my uh, turbines panel for four turbines. Um, yesterday I got flustered because I was thinking well gee I haven't hooked this up and that up I'm going home. Well, primarily is to have some power that I don't have to run off the generator to get me through the night that could run you know the small medical equipment that I need and doodad so that's its primary purpose and uh, you know, in the spring when it's warm and toasty I can uh, do otherwise but uh, this pile over here this pile number six number four number four wire uh, and actually let me get a close up of it. That is not a lead or copper uh, fitting. It's obviously steel that's rusted. A lot of them rusted if they're exposed to the elements. Tractor supply. Thought I was getting a good deal. But if you don't have a good connection, you don't have a good deal. This is your heart, your system. Connectors, you know, should be a good quality so that you can get to the other part of your heart or your system. Everything else, if you cut corners, it's not going to work. Bottom line. So, I have a good charge control charger there that can switch between 12 and 24 so I can charge up car and golf cart and such or uh, <laughs> when it has to back all <laughs> uh, if we get that going this spring it'll be nice but uh, yeah ta-ta for now